Hi everyone! In this example, I'm going to show how to edit the record in the table. First of all, let's imagine that we have a table of books in the database. Each book has its own title of a string type, author of a string type, and genre of enum types. We have a several here predefined. I already have my web application assembled and it has its functionality for adding the books. So I can add any book here. But now let's add the possibility to edit and delete the data in the table. First of all, let's navigate to the web designer section. and create a new global variable here. We need this global variable here for passing the data from the table row into the modal window. So let's select the integer type. And for example, let's make it book ID. That's kinda it. Let's navigate back to the application designer. Once we have our global variable defined, we can make the edit book module to be opened once the button is clicked. But first of all, let's edit the book module itself. We need a few components to be added here. First of all, we need the book title. We need also the same component for author name. And we need select a num component to select the genre. Okay, that's it. We can save our model. Then let's create a new business process for edit button. As it was set, it will be triggered on click trigger. First of all, let's open our model. Model show and specify the component ID of the model we are looking for. It will be the edit book. Then we need to pass the raw ID, which is actually the record ID here, into the global variable state. So let's find our global variable, its book ID, and let's also use set variable block for setting the value into the variable. We want the modal fields to be predefined once the modal is opened. So we need to pass the data from the record into this field. How to do this? We can use the update type of blocks. So let's find input string, update properties for our title component and for name component. And let's also find select enum update properties block to update our genre. Specify the components ID here. These values can be obtained from the book record. So let's find the get book ID block. And provide the book ID we already know to get the book object from the database. To get the properties of the book object, we are going to use expand book type of block. So just provide the title, author, and genre to the components we just defined. And save the business process. 
and let's navigate back to edit book module. Let's open the save button and add a new business process here. Once the button is clicked, we need to get the data from the components of the model and patch the book record with the given fields. So let's just use the get properties types of block for both string components. and for the enum select. Once we have all the data here, we can make the book object. With the provided fields. Also specify the book ID, which we already have in our global variable. Now we are ready to patch our book record. Provide the book object into the block. And if the request is successful, we want to actually hide the model. Specify the model ID. And the last step, we want to update table with the new data. Just find the get book type of block to get the book data from the database and provide it to the table. Table update data block has to be used for this. Specify the component ID of the table. That's pretty it. Our business process is ready. Let's save it. save our application. Let's see the functionality we just added. Open the published application. Let's edit one of the books here. As we can see, all these fields are predefined here, once we open the model. So let's change it to be detective and save the changes. As we can see, the record was updated here.